What is going on guys and girls? In today's video, I'll be attempting to write a 8,000 word blog post in less than 10 minutes using the new GPT 3.5 Turbo 16K mode. So essentially, there's been a new model that's been released by OpenAI. This is the GPT 3.5 upgraded model. It's called the GPT 3.5 Turbo 16K. So that means that you're able to have up to 16,000 token limits. So that means you're able to write a lot more words and the AI is able to read a lot more content compared to the regular GPT 3.5 Turbo model. So let's see how fast we can write an 8,000 word blog post using this new model. So first I've went ahead and primed the AI by telling it it's an expert blog post writer specializing in writing long form articles about how to become a real estate investor. And the prompt for the outline will be your first task is to write an in-depth and comprehensive blog post outline on this topic. Include as much information as possible about this blog post topic. Be exhaustive and include every question or topic a person would have for this blog post. So we're going to decrease the temperature just a tad. I'm going to increase the maximum length. And then I'm going to increase the frequency penalty just a little bit as well, and also the presence penalty. So now that we have our settings, I'll actually be using the GPT-4 model to generate the outline because I find that you're able to get much better outlines from GPT-4 because it's a little bit more powerful and a little bit more smarter. And then we're going to use GPT-3.5, the upgraded 16K model, to then write the full article. Okay, so this is the full outline that we get back. And as we can see, it's very, very in-depth. And if we're writing a long article, we need to have a very in-depth outline. So we get the intro, understanding real estate investing, perks and challenges, essential skills, getting started, evaluating and analyzing investment properties, financing real estate investments, closing the deal, tax, growing your real estate investment portfolio, and a conclusion. So a nice long and in-depth outline. So now we're going to give it the prompt to write the full article. And for that method, we'll be using the GPD 3.5 Turbo 16 mode. So the prompt I'll be using is write this full article, be as in-depth as possible, include long, insightful, and engaging paragraphs, always include tables and lists, write in more than format, and write, and remember to write a lot of relevant and unique content for this blog post. Also, write section by section. So we want to start with section number one, which is the intro, and then when it finishes writing that section, I will then tell the AI when to continue writing. Now, this method I've found allows us to get much longer um, outputs because the AI is able to kind of spread up its writing and write the first section, then the second section, which allows you to get an overall longer output. So as we can see, it has followed those instructions, but again, it's not writing section by section. So sometimes that is um, the issue when you using GPT 3.5 is that it really doesn't listen to exactly what you want it to do. So I'm going to um, edit the prompt once more so that it um, just writes the first section and then stops and then I uh, will continue once I tell it to do so. So I've tweaked the prompt by telling it to remember only to write one section at a time. Also, if you would like us to write you a free article of your choice, check out the link in the description below this video. Just give us the blog post topic. We'll write you a free article. And if you like the service, you can then get a paid package in which we write content for you based upon your niche. So if you would like to try out our blog writing service, I'll leave a link in the description below this video. So I've went ahead and pasted in the article into a markdown to HTML converter and the word count is about 6,500 words. So we do have some more um, sections left. So let's go ahead and continue finishing this article so that we can hit that 8,000 word um, length. So I've continued writing the article until the very end. Um, there still is one section for the conclusion, but I've went ahead and converted that over into HTML. And as we can see here, the word count is about 7,900 words. And if I add it in a conclusion, it would definitely be 8,000 words. So as you guys can see, it's pretty simple for you to generate a high quality, but very long and very in-depth article using the new GPT 3.5 Turbo 16K mode. As you guys saw, the prompts were pretty simple and it was easy to get the AI to write the content. The only thing that took long was actually waiting for the AI to write the content. All we had to do is sit back and let the AI do its thing. And as you can see here, we have an 8,000 word blog post in less than 10 to 15 minutes. So I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. I'll probably be doing some other um, tutorials of the new GPT 3.5 Turbo mode because there's a lot more use cases because you have a lot more token limits um, to play with. So let me know in the comments below if you guys have any specific use cases or content in which you would like me to create using the new model. As always, I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, let it be known by giving us a big thumbs up and subscribing to the channel if you haven't already. Until next time, stay well.
Also, if you'd like us to write you a free article of your choice, check out the link in the description below this video. Just give us the blog post topic, we'll write you a free article. And if you like the service, you can then get a paid package in which we write content for you based upon your niche. So if you would like to try out our blog writing service, I'll leave a link in the description below this video.